Hi, I'm Natalie, the Feline Nurse Manager at Cat Specialist Services and today Moriarty and I are going to go through how to do a uh, blood glucose ear tip um, prick on their ear. So basically what you want is for your cat to be nice and comfortable and for this to be a nice pleasant experience. There are sort of glucose readers um, that you can purchase at your chemist or recommended by us or your uh, regular vet. Um, we use the AlphaTrack a lot in clinic and then there's at least two options that you can do at home in order to get your sample. First of all in clinic or if you have access there are these little lancets that come now what they are is you just twist this top off and there's just a little lancet under underneath. Your other option is just a, a needle as well. So just a sharp edge basically. Now from there you want to have your equipment ready and also to where we're going to aim is sort of on the inside of their ear pinna and there's generally this vein that runs on the outside edge of their ear and just see where there is a nice sort of vein visible but generally if you are aiming for the outside you should be good. Now to get the blood a bit more to the surface of the ear you can also wet a swab with some warm water and apply it to their ear prior to doing this. So apply it on there sort of 30 seconds to a minute, however long they tolerate, and then you're good to go from there. Now, what you want to do is then put a strip in to your glucose monitor. Just follow the arrow and then it'll turn on and then you're good to go once it sets. <laughs> so it pretty much has this blood droplet here and you're pretty much aiming for your blood sample to be at this bottom bit. From there, get your lancet or your needle and you'll just want to quickly pinprick the, that vein that we noticed before. From there, you'll just squeeze firmly slash gently on that ear and you'll notice a little bead of blood. So you'll want to get a pretty reasonable size bead of blood and from there you would put the edge of your glucose monitor onto that and then it will suck up into your machine and get your reading. So that's how you perform an ear tip glucose check on your cat at home or in clinic um, and if you have any further questions feel free to give us a call at cat specialist services or jump on our website as well thank you